We got some real information about Galaxy S24 Ultra and it is now 100% confirmed what we are going to get out of the S24 Ultra. And yes, the new displays are coming, but there is a good and there is a bad news. Lately, we got our first look at the Galaxy S24 Ultra and now there are a couple of things confirmed regarding the S24 Ultra. According to Ice Universe, Galaxy S24 Ultra were going to come with a 6.78 inches display with the 3120 into 1440 display resolution with the aspect ratio of 19.5 ratio 9. Interestingly, it's changed. The aspect ratio was different on all the previous models of Galaxy S series lineup, which means it is getting real that Galaxy S24 Ultra will be a wider phone compared to the previous generations. This year, S23 Ultra came with 19.3 ratio 9. And one of the most important part, Galaxy S24 Ultra were going to come with the 2500 net speed brightness. Remember, in my last couple of videos, I shared that it will come with the 2500 net speed brightness and now Ice Universe confirmed it. One of the most important thing, the data regarding the renders of Galaxy S24 Ultra was true and even supply chain confirmed the renders of Galaxy S24 Ultra, meaning this is what we are going to get. The curved display is no more, hence we are going to see a flat display on the Galaxy S24 Ultra. Even confirmed from 4 6 prototypes, the sides and even the bottom looks the same as renders, meaning both S24 Ultra and 4 6 were going to have a similar design next year, with a wider cover display on the 4 6 and overall wider body of Galaxy S24 Ultra at 79mm, and the bezels on S24 Ultra didn't get better. But Samsung is going to add symmetrical bezels on S24 Ultra, meaning all four sides will have the same width. The only problem with the Galaxy S24 Ultra is the frame, not the bezels. Because when you compare both silver and black version of S24 Ultra, you can clearly tell the difference. The black looks really bad, but the silver looks really good. It is all because Samsung is going to give us the same size frame as the inner bezels. So if you want the best experience with the new display, you should go for silver sides instead of black. It's important to mention that Samsung is going to change the sides with the titanium frame, which makes S24 Ultra more durable, but the weight of the phone will remain the same, only 1 gram lighter than the S23 Ultra, at 233 grams which is going to be heavier than the iPhone 15 Pro Max. Samsung will going out with the S24 Ultra in the Feb next year. I've got some amazing news about the processor and performance of Galaxy S24 Ultra which you should watch in this video and I hope you guys are subscribed. I'll see you next time till then. Peace out.